Little update on the motor. Um, got it all torn apart. Pistons are out of it and everything. Uh, there's no grooving or any kind of the uh, markings on the crank. It's all nice and smooth, which made me happy. Won't have to get that worked over. I got all of the pistons out. Um, they probably were getting close to needing the bearings replaced anyways, because you, they're all. You can see, I don't know if it's copper or bronze, but it looks like copper. And you see all the bearings are worn down, like every single one of them. But that, I guess that's what you see off of 200,000 miles. This is the piston that uh, had problems with. It literally has a giant gap that goes on the inside of the ring and out the bottom. So I'm pretty sure it, it didn't have much compression in that zone. I never, I didn't do a compression test on it, so I don't know how bad it really was, but, um, I haven't, I'm not going to take off the mains yet. I don't, I'm just going to wait until I get my kit. I want to keep the crank in there, but I've got this off as an important part. One second, let me just flip this stand. Look at the cylinders. I haven't even done this yet. I just got finished taking them off. Oh, I think it's still heavy even without fucking anything on it. Alright. Yes, I know I'm wearing flip flops. I don't care. It's hot outside. Um, was it this one? No, I don't think it was either of these. Not that one. These all feel nice. I don't feel anything in any of these. No, it's this side. Um, right here, I've got like minor scarring on that piston that was blown. It's not bad. I think if I it doesn't look bad anyways. It actually looks like the piston just added when it was going apart. It looks like it added to it right there, just right there though. Everything else, all the cylinders look beautiful. For 200,000 miles, I'm not upset about that. The worst thing is this one. I might just get a honing stone and just clean that up a little bit, or I might go send it to go get bored out. I'm not really sure yet. Uh, that's the update on it. I really haven't gotten anything else. Um, actually, I might have. I don't know if in my last video if I did. I don't think I had this, but I got the bell housing from the Dodge Dakota and it just bolts up. Looks like the old bell housing in there. And I got my shift tower. So that's that's yay. That's another thing I have done. Yay. Um, when I ever get the new set of pistons, or if I send it to get bored out, I'll make another video for the update. Um, have a nice day.